right folks here we are going to learn how to save your favorites so you can access them remotely or anywhere um, or even put them on another computer basically on your internet explorer here mine's set up over here on the right uh, you just click your file go to import and export you get a little wizard here that says welcome you click next you're going to click on export favorites click next you just click the box for favorites for everything click next now it's going to give you uh, the location where you're going to save this um, like let's just say it's always going to call it bookmark let's say you want to save it to your desktop okay you click save next and finish and there we go successfully exported favorites and I'll be back in a minute to show you now what that looks like okay so here we are I just opened up a little uh, explorer to find the bookmark file on my desktop um, I'm just keeping the window small. I don't want you to see all my private files. So this is basically an HTML document, anything that Internet Explorer would open up. By double clicking it, uh, there we go. There's my file. These are my folders that were in my favorites. For example, I had a folder named Appraisal. Within it, I had a folder named ACI. And within that, I had the link to this web page. And that's how it organizes all your, your favorites. Um, you can do two things with this bookmark file. Number one is you can email it to yourself to a free Yahoo account or Hotmail or whatever you have and uh, go into that email and you know open the attachment from wherever you're at remotely uh, you know if you're at the office or home or on vacation or choice two if you're a little more advanced is you can actually upload this to a server uh, you know and give it a crazy file name and just kinda like a little backdoor for yourself uh, for example you know www.mydomain.com slash cool bookmarks or something like that would you know allow you to access this and have all your your favorites from uh, on the go so either email it to yourself uh, put it up on a web page somewhere or uh, you could even carry it around on a jump drive and just open it up from from anywhere uh, any computer that you know you can accept the jump drive with so uh, there you go